Hi YouTubers, it's Tequila again. Um, I thought I'd do a quick video um, showing you how I store my makeup and what all I have accumulated in the last year. Believe it or not, I've only been into nails and makeup for the last year. I've been such a tomboy my whole life. And this is a newfound hobby of mine and I just love it. So I hope you enjoy the video. Thanks. This is my pigments that I have. I don't have very many. I do have some on the way in the mail. Um, but I do have a few that I just love. This is like my favorite, favorite color for the eyelid. Love it. Um, I just got this one in the mail. Yes, um, Saturday I think it was. And I used it today. It's not exactly the color I thought it was going to be. But, you know, it was cheap. So, you know, I'm happy to have it. But, so these are my pigments that I have here. The loose ones that I have. Okay, and then we're going to come down to the drawer, right under it here, and this is where I keep all my jumbo eye pencils. I'm not sure if you can see that color, but I have you know, just a lot of those. I love these. They're really good for when you're in a hurry, in my opinion. So, and now they're going to close. Okay, down here are my liquid eyeliners that I have. As you can see, I love glittery things. If it is glittery, I want it. I have a bunch of those. Oh, my all-time favorite color in the world. Look at that purple. And it's so pretty. Okay, so those are my liquid eyeliners. When you come down here, and these are just some of the single um, eyeshadows I have and some of the doubles that I have in here. Not very many of those. Oh, this is not that pretty. Love it. Okay. So we're going to come down to this drawer. This actually goes to my nails. This is my nail file drawer. It has all my nail files. I love the 180 grit. That's like the best to use on your nails. Okay. And then in this next drawer I have, not sure how well you can see it, but here I have, on this side, is all my lipsticks. I'm not a big lipstick fan, but I will apply it at least once a day. I have a few lip glosses here, and these are all eye palettes, eyeshadow palettes that I've gotten. This is, this is the one from Wet n Wild, and this one from Wet n Wild. This is a MAC glitters. The glitter. And all those are eyeshadow palettes. I actually use this today. And over here I have my blushes and my bronzers. Um, this is this extra bottle of Urban Decay Primer Potion. And that's all that's in there. And then you come down. This is all my feet product. You know, you got to keep your feet nice and soft. You don't want to scratch your husband in bed. So, I keep my feet nice and soft. This stuff from Avon is really good. That's it. And then you come down here in this drawer. I have all my art nail polishes to do art on the nail. I've gotten these from eBay. I haven't used them yet. They seem to be a little thin, but uh, maybe I'll do a tutorial on some nails using these and seeing how they go. Love my nail polishes. Okay, in this drawer I have um, ma uh, mainly blue, purples, greens, um, clears, my white. I put them on here. As you can see, I'm a big glitter fan. I love it with the glitters. Shimmery, all that. Okay. And then down here I keep the brighter colors, the reds, the oranges, yellows. Oh, look at this. Gold. Ain't that pretty? I just love it. This is a really pretty color. Really pretty. Okay. Then we're going to come back up here that I have. Okay. This is where I keep my smaller my foundation brushes and things in that area. These are my pencil eyeliners I have. I like a variety of colors. 
that's what those are. Over there are my Tic Tacs. Can't do makeup without cherry Tic Tacs. Love them. I only have a few lip eyeliners, lip liners, because I don't really wear a lot of lipstick. It's very, um, once a day at least, though. And this brush I just use to dust the whole area. I don't even use it for my face. Then you come over here, and this is where I keep my mascaras. And this is my mascara, my favorite mascara of all times. It's Super Shock from Avon. I'm going to tell you, if you ever use this, you won't use anything else. It is the best. See that? There we go. Not sure how well you can see it, but it's a really, really good brush. Look, you can see my pajamas. Yes, I got off work. It went straight into my pajamas and cooked dinner for my family. Okay, another auto of my Urban Decay Primer. I keep these things in here for when I need to use it with um, pigments for my eyes. Got a few sponges. I don't even use these, but they're cool to have, I guess. I actually ordered this from Urban Decay, and it doesn't really work. I'm kind of disappointed in it. Maybe I'm not using it right, but I read the directions, and I did what it said to do. It still isn't working. Okay, and these are my large palettes that I have that I've gotten off of eBay. This is my favorite one so far. I have more coming in the mail. Look at that those colors and they're really really pigmented they're really good on the color I was so surprised something so cheap would be so colorful very nice very nice moving on this is where I keep my lotions uh, this is like the best lotion in the world midnight pomegranate from Bath and Body Works it's my favorite scent have some more there this is my face powder makeup remover and I have a bottle of makeup remover here and this body spray if you can't guess it is midnight pomegranate love it okay moving up here these are all my false eyelashes I don't know how to use false eyelashes but for some reason I keep buying them and I get such good deals on eBay look at these it has stones on them already this has blue stones so pretty those purple my favorite color oh and this one isn't this awesome I would love to put these on I just don't know how I've tried I bought the gadgets to put them on with right here if anybody has any suggestions on how to put on eye lashes please shoot me a comment to let me know and I keep some more in here over here is the stuff for my hair hair accessories right here I keep my makeup sponges cotton balls makeup pad removers I come in here into this little container. Here I keep all my nail stones, my nail art stones. I've got just tons of them. I have so much fun doing nails. And people around me are enjoying it too because they do it for free. These I haven't even touched out plastic yet. Very pretty. So that's what it's all in here. This is and then we'll move down to the first drawer, which is where I keep my acrylics. In this drawer, I keep the purples, the greens, and the blues. Um, I just got this today. I think it's going to be really, really pretty. I can't wait to put that on. So that's what I keep in here. And my blacks as well. In the next drawer, I keep the brighter acrylics. The reds, the oranges, the yellows, the pinks. All of those are in here. I got this one today and I have a feeling that that is going to be like burgundy and it's going to be so pretty. Okay, on the bottom one is where I keep more of the gold, um, copper. This one reminded me of a penny. How pretty is that? And the whites and I keep that in that drawer. Now I'm moving over here. Move this over here. In this drawer, I keep some more nail art. These are for the striping. Very pretty. And then stickers. I don't really use a lot of stickers. I don't like them. I'd rather put on the... And here's where I keep the Conad stuff. Let's see if I can get it out. Okay. So I got a few. Some of them are off-brand. 
ones that I've gotten. That's pretty cool. And the bottom drawer here is just more stones, more nail art things, beads. Aren't those pretty? Not quite sure how to use these yet, but I am sure I'll figure it out. Okay, and this drawer is where I keep the nail tools, is what I call it. And right here is nail clippers, tweezers, scissors. This is to pierce your nail to put the nail rings in. All that kind of stuff is in there. Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna miss here. The daughters. I love this. They're really awesome. And in this drawer are my brushes. And down here is where I keep the glues and the acrylic paint to do nail art on. Okay, moving down to the big blue drawer is where I keep my false nails. And I have tons of false nail tips. This goes on and on and on. These are really cool. I'm not sure if you can see them, but they're already... They got this pointed ridge at the smile line. Maybe I'll use them in a tutorial so you can see what I'm talking about. They're really awesome. And then we got these here and here. I like to use the color nail tips if I'm doing like if I'm doing purple. I, I would use a purple nail tip if I had it. It just helps with the color, especially when you use a lot of glitter. It, it's not really dark in color, so that helps. Okay, and over here is just the clear and the pink that you would use. And there's a second level of those right there. Okay. And in this drawer, I have one of my UV lamps, have UV gels. I didn't really care for this one at all. And I recently got these, and these worked a lot better. So, this is my nail oil. This is my favorite nail oil of all times. I got it on eBay, and it's awesome. This is my dipping jars. These I've not been able to use yet. Um, but this is to make your own nails. And I'm watching tutorials on YouTube now trying to learn how to do that. Okay, and this is for your cuticles. This cuticle away, it's really good. Liquid ac acrylic right there. Okay, and these I've not used yet either. And they're supposed to be really good to taking off false nails. You know, so you don't have to get stuck with your hand in a bowl. You can just stick these on your fingers. And I got some more nail oils in here that I didn't really care for. But they are convenient. And this is what I call my random drawer. Down here is where I keep all my random things. Right here I keep um, my nail file drill, which I don't really use. I'm perfectly happy using the nail files at 180 grit. These were my soaking dishes that I haven't used in forever. As well, cotton balls, extra containers where I've already used the acrylic out of that I've ordered. And I actually have two nail drills in here. I ordered this pink one and I really didn't care for it. Okay, and down here I keep um, my acetone, paper towels, the spray to help dry the um, nail polish faster, alcohol, um, nail polish remover, things like that. And this is my tripod, which I love. And it's another UV lamp that I recently got that I like a lot better than the other one that I have. So, sure. This is where I keep all my extra Bath & Body Works products. Um, more body sprays. And surprisingly, Midnight Pomegranate Hand Sanitizer. I love it. More lotions in there. I keep my sunglasses. That way they don't get all scratched up. In this drawer, too. More sunglasses that I have for today. Well, I hope you enjoy the tour of how I store all my makeup and nails and everything. And... Um, any comments that you have, I'd appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe. And you have a blessed evening. God bless. Bye.